Hi there, this is Alejandro from ForexVPS.net. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install several MT4s from the same broker into your VPS. So first we'll need to log into the VPS. Let's wait for it to connect. All right. Once we are in, we're going to need, of course, an MT4 installer. Here I have one from Blueberry Markets. We'll need to first install one MT4. We'll just normally open it next and wait until it's done. All right. Now that it's done, we'll just have to click on finish. We'll have to give it a few seconds because it's going to configure the MT4 and open it for the first time. So in this case, I can just minimize this MT4. Don't need to do anything else. And here I have the shortcut. The first thing I'm going to do is to change the name of this shortcut. You can right click, rename, or you can also select it and press F2. I'm going to add a one in the end of this shortcut. Why? Because when the next shortcut is created, it's going to be named the same as this one and it would overwrite it. So we'll want to have two. Again, I'm going to open the installer. And now, instead of uh, just installing and clicking Next, I'm going to click Settings. And in here, I'm going to check the Installation folder, and I'm going to add the 2 at the end. Of course, you can add whatever you want. It doesn't need to be a number. It just needs to be different. So in this case, it will create a new folder. Instead of being called Blueberry Markets MT4 Terminal, the new folder will be Blueberry Markets MT4 Terminal 2. So this way, it will not overwrite it and wait until the uh, installation is done. All right, so now I can press and finish. And we see now that we have Terminal 1 shortcut, and we can name this one Terminal 2 in case we want to install a third one and not have it overgridden. And now I have two MT4s running, both from the same broker, Blueberry Markets. If you have any other questions or inquiries, you can always come to our customer care department via live chat or sending us an email. Thank you.